Hey socialites, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Ariel. I create mostly beauty videos, a little bit of fashion, as well as lifestyle vlogs. So be sure to hit the subscribe button so you too can become a socialite. So today is gonna be a get unready with me. You guys are gonna see how I basically tear this all down at the end of the night. I do have sort of a routine, like the steps I like to go in that's most comfortable for me. Before I get started with my skincare, I do want to thank Exuviance and Magic Links for partnering with me on this video. So before I start my skincare, I like to wash my hands first and that's because I wear contacts and I'm trying my best not to sleep in my contacts. You guys, on a previous vlog, I briefly touched on it, but I recently went to get new glasses and get my new eye exam and my vision has drastically changed in the worst way <laughs> and my doctor contributes a lot of it to sleeping in contact so I try to make sure I take out my contacts so I'm going to start off by washing my hands and get these contacts out of my eyes Then I'm gonna go in with my Elemis Cleansing Balm. Now I got this in my um, advent calendar during the holidays and it's just like an oily solution. And then work my way everywhere else after my eyes. And then I'm gonna rinse this with cool water. So now that I got that sort of like pre-cleanse out of the way, I'm gonna go in with my facial cleanser. And for that, I like to use the Skin Script Raspberry Refining Cleanser. You guys, I've talked about this in my last skincare video. There's a few cleansers that I really like, but this one I'm like obsessed with. So I just like to sort of lather it in first. And I do like to pay extra special attention to the areas that I tend to get the most breakouts and hyperpigmentation. I like to show those areas a little extra love because I've noticed that whenever I do get um, breakouts or anything, it's always in the same spot, which is right here. So I always like to give this area here a little extra love. And then I go in to really get a deep lather with the water and rinse it off with cool water. And when I dry my face, I do like to keep like paper towels or I have like face cleansing wipes to just like, they're dry, just like what you dry your face with because I don't like to use towels to dry my face. I just feel like it holds bacteria and coming from a person that gets breakouts every now and again, I like to just use something fresh that hasn't been, you know what I mean, used already every single time. So now I'm going in to exfoliate. This is a new product that I was introduced to. I actually had this on my May favorites because I was so impressed by it. This is the Exuvion's Triple Microdermabrasion Face Polish. So they did send over several different things for me to test out and some of them really stood out to me. And this was definitely one of them. You guys, this is a really good if you have sensitive skin, I would say only use a little bit with a light hand, maybe once a week or so, because this is one of those exfoliators that really gets in there. So if you want sort of that deep cleansing to really work at getting those rough areas or that sort of semi top layer off of there, this is what you need. And I think it has the perfect name when it says polish because it leaves your face with just sort of a smooth polished look. Y'all, this is really good, super impressed. Comment down below and let me know if you've tried this before, Microdermabrasion Face Polish. So, just go right in with this. Now, this is something that the directions say you can use about two to three times a week. I would start off with one time a week just because it is sort of on that abrasive side. So start off with once and then sort of work your way up to like two to three times a week. That's what I'm doing. And keep in mind, this does have AHA in it. So if you're gonna be out in the sun and everything like that, you wanna be careful in conjunction with vitamin C's and stuff like that. But this is a really, really good one. This is that product that with the recent breakout that I had maybe about three or four weeks ago, it left texture and this really helped to like smooth that texture out and sort of get that layer off. So now I can sort of concentrate 
more so on the lightening um the the hyperpigmentation which is what i was looking for i was looking for a product like this and then i'm just gonna rinse with cool water so my go-to toner is the caudaly veno clean toner this is probably like my third bottle or so of this i think it's like my third bottle i really like this toner this is one of those standout products that sort of help my skin to turn around maybe about a year or so ago one of the sephora reps recommended this to me along with um something else and i've been using it ever since now i'm gonna go in with my vitamin c this is a face oil and with this face oil you guys this is one of those products that i like to sit into my skin like five minutes or so five to 10 minutes before I go in with the moisturizer, just because I like for it to really get a chance to seep into the skin. So usually at this point, after I put the face oil in, I go and lotion my body down, cause I do this right after my shower. So I just go ahead and do my nighttime body care while this is soaking in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. For body care, you guys, this is a, let me show y'all my routine. This is a routine that I've been doing for like months now, probably since, it's definitely been at least two months, <laughs> probably three, because this is like my second or third one of these, the um, Midnight Amber Glow body cream that I've gone through. I've already gone through like at least one or two of these already. So what I do is I go first in with my baby oil gel. I put this all over my body. I heavily put it on like my belly and like my little love handles area because I've gained weight. I've gained like 20, 25 pounds. So since I've gained this weight, I like to put extra oil on those areas because you know, as you stretch, when you gain weight, you can get stretch marks. So I put extra on like my belly and my love handles. And then I go in with Midnight Amber Glow from Bath & Body Works. This is a beautiful amber scent, you guys. I love this so, so much. They stopped selling this, I think, though. I don't think they have this anymore. It was like a limited thing, but if they ever bring this back, you guys need to do yourself a favor and stock up. So I lotion my body down with this after the baby oil gel. And then I do the Zhirzhoff's Dama Bianca. This is the fragrance that I wear to bed because it's so light and just really, it's just really soft. It's, it's a delicate fragrance. It's like a soft vanilla that's really soft and delicate, a little sweet. And it's really nice. Mister loves it. Like if I don't wear this to bed, he thinks I'm mad. <laughs> but I love this. So I just spray this like here a little bit like on the back of my neck and then a little bit on the back of the knees. If you know, you know. So for moisturizer, I'm going to use my IT Cosmetics Confident and Confidence in Your Beauty Sleep. And for eye cream, you guys, every since I got the PR box from them, I've been wearing this. This is the Exuviance Daily Eye Smoother. You guys, 10 out of 10 on this eye smoother. I love a good eye cream that brightens and softens at the same time and smooths. And that's what this does. It just really brightens your under eye. I don't know if you guys can see that my under eye is significantly lighter. It's not like a little off. It's significantly lighter than the rest of my face, you guys. So I've been using this for weeks now and it is everything. I use it twice a day. So when I do my daytime routine, I use this and my nighttime routine. It, it just feels, oh, it's just so buttery and just creamy and just, ah. If you've ever tried this before, comment down below and um, let the socialites know what you think about it because I am obsessed. It feels so yummy. Texture sometimes can be everything with products and this feels so yummy. Not only that, it really does a good job. It's smoothing and it brightens. I love when I get a good eye cream that does a good brightening job. This is everything. The last, I'm just gonna go ahead and moisturize my lips with the, um, this is the Fenty, plush pudding it's really good 
I do have a discount code for you guys if you're interested in getting some of these products from Exuviance. One of the socialites told me that their peel pads is really good too, so I'm definitely gonna try that out next. I was really debating if I should try that out because I did see it on the website, and being that somebody recommended it to me, I think I wanna check that out as well. She said it's they have that and it's good too um, because she did try the microdermabrasion that I told you guys about. So I'm thinking about getting that, but yeah, I'm enjoying these products. So I do have a discount code for you guys with Exuvians. I'll also have it in the description box, which is Ariel20. So that's it for this Get Ready With Me. Thank you all so much for watching. Everything I use will be linked down below in the description box, so be sure to check that out. If you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit subscribe on your way out, and I'll see you on the next one. Cause I've been where you are You're too scared to show me love Cause too fresh with the scars Well I don't have the answers, answers. So I won't tell you lies